Hi, I'm sweating to the uh, 90 plus temperature, um, <laughs> heat wave, drought conditions, all that stuff that's hit uh, the U.S. Anyway, I'm doing a quick little video on uh, one of the most useful plants I've found. Uh, this is from a general uh, human perspective. You don't have to be in the military to, to like this plant. Uh, so anyway, what we got here, it's called a aloe vera. I picked this one up from uh, Walmart, incredibly, for uh, $4.88. And uh, wow, what a value. Um, it's a medicinal plant. Right now, we're not talking marijuana or uh, along those lines. This is a sort of a, a plant that allows you to heal faster. Um, the uh, the point of it is uh, you'll find it in a lot of uh, salves and things, or salves. How do you say that? For sunburn. Um, whoop! Got a little pop up. Don't fix this. Uh, <clears throat> but anyway, if you have a, a cut or bruise or some abrasion or something like that, chances are, if you were to snap a little piece off this and squirt the gel on it, your uh, situation would improve faster than if you hadn't. And so, it's a really nice plant. Uh, kind of feels like it's full of gel in a way, kind of like filling a toothpaste tube or something. And it functions pretty much the same way. You snap off a piece and you uh, squirt it out on your injury. It's a gel water. Uh, you can do your own research uh, on this fantastic plant. It's, it likes sunlight. Uh, it doesn't like to get watered a lot. I read that off a little tag there, by the way. Um, so, it's pretty much a very useful uh, house plant. A um, little bit of uh, trivia, when I was in Iraq, uh, I chanced by an old Iraqi uh, medical uh, facility, which had been, of course, confiscated and uh, re redone as an American medical facility. But guess what they had out front, on the front pavilion there? They had a bunch of aloe vera amazingly sitting there in these little uh, uh, like uh, flower pot doohickeys made out of adobe and, and you know box type so aloe vera is known the world over different cultures different places as a fantastic uh, healer and just uh, just uh, really recommend you get one of these and learn how to care for it and uh, they live for a long time. Um, I had one, my mom had one, and I, it, it, I don't remember it dying. I left home, and it was still alive. So, uh, anyway, that's my little video. Uh, I'm just dying in the seed here, but I thought that uh, might as well do something. Try to keep this uh, channel alive here. Alright. So support my subscribers, uh, they support me, and um, what do you call, you have a good one, I'll figure out other things to bring up, and my, my channel will improve, it's just, I've been through a lot of transitions, as you can tell, the background changed and stuff, so, a little bit, a little bit of a, a little bit of sleuthing and interpolation, you can kind of understand what the deal is, but, then again, maybe you won't. So, at any rate, um, that was my aloe vera feature presentation. I don't have a cut or anything, otherwise I'd <coughs> maybe snap a little bit off and show you how to use it. But it's very simple, and I just don't want to damage it. A lot of times you find aloe veras where they've been snapped off. Of. It's kind of hard to find one where <coughs> it's uh, intact. <coughs> So, at any rate, um, if you do use one, don't use it too much. You'll end up killing it, I guess. But 
little little bit here and there, a little bit of fair trade, keep it alive, it'll keep you healing like that. But find out about these plants. They're they're cheap, they're easy to care for, they're useful, they don't smell or anything, and they're kind of fun to touch. It's like it's like anyway. Alright, so there you go. A little tactile inside there. Okay. Tactile and tactical. Okay. I'm just going to sit here and sweat a little bit more, and uh, that's in this video for now. Got to upload this sucker. Okay, you have a good one.